Hello, everyone. Lovely to see so many familiar foreheads. For the unfamiliar, my name is Raylan Yant, and I play the Yangqin, also known as the Chinese hammered dulcimer. The Yangqin is a descendant of the Persian santur. It has 144 strings on it, and you know, I'm not gonna say any more about it. Every time I perform, people need me to explain the origin story of the Yangqin, and it's kind of like the musical equivalent of saying, where are you from? Um, so I think I'm gonna leave it up to mystery for, for three reasons, really. Um, the first is that he speaks for himself. And yes, he's called he. This young chin's name is Sting, like Frodo's sword. Not like the pop star, although I do have a sweet spot for him. Um, the second reason is that it was through listening to the Yangqin without knowing anything about it. And I was seven years old in San Francisco, taking in its iridescent magic, just for what it was, that I came to fall in love with it. And I hope that by the end of today, you can feel some of that love. And reason number three, Wikipedia is a great site it has a lot of information, really all you need to know. And especially live stream people, you can just look it up, okay? So if you really care, look it up, okay? It's spelled Y-A-N-G-Q-I-N, pronounced Yang Qin, not Yang Queen. I'm the Yang Queen. I would now love to welcome, uh, speaking of queens, <laughs> Romy to the stage. Give it up for Romy um, and her Gujang. Uh, and Romy, we actually go way back. Yeah, we really yeah. do. Do you do you remember how we met? I, I was born. I was born. I always yeah. forget. I always forget. Oh. We're sisters. sisters. Can you tell? Sisters for life. But yeah, do you want to? Oh yes, tell me about yes. Thank you. Um, so hi, my name is Romy, and the instrument that I'm going to be playing today is called the Gu Zheng. Um, it is the ancient Chinese table harp, or zither, and it has 21 strings to the Yang Qing's 144. So we'll take what we can get. Um, and it is played with turtle shell nails on your hands. So it's China's original manicure. Yes, work. Yes. So um, today, we are going to be playing a couple of duets together um, along with the other pieces. And the first piece we're going to be playing is called Da Lang Tao Sha. Great Waves Tossing the Sand.
like to invite Michelle Cho to the stage. She'll be playing piano with us today. And next up, we're going to travel to France and hear a song, an art song, called En Sourdine by Forêt. And it is a setting of a Paul Berlin poem. It's very beautiful. Um, and we've arranged it together for Yang Qin and piano almost as a love song between these two instruments, percussive string instruments, percussive string romance. And the title, En Sourdine, means muted in French. So next time if you want to sound fancy on a Zoom call, you can say, Dave, you're en soldine. <laughs> Dave, you're en soldine. So you're welcome for that one. And then after that, we're going to play a piece composed by Wang Se, who is a Yangqin professor in Beijing, who comes from a family of bamboo mallet craftspeople. And I think what you might pick up on a little bit here is the connection that I'm beginning to feel attracted to between contemporary Chinese music and a lot of Impressionist and Romantic music. Um, still sort of learning what that connection is. So would love for you to listen for that as well. You can let me know after the show.
Thank you so much, Michelle. So for this next piece, I'm going to call up more of the band. So we're going to bring back Romy on guzheng. We're going to bring in Eliza Millet on cello, Alieta Fundenkos on violin, and Dave Shaw on a very small viola, and Jordan Murray on percussion. So 1-1 one, one by Brian Eno is perhaps my favorite composition by an English composer. It's this ambient piece from the album Music for Airports, and it is so beautiful. And we're not playing that for you today. Um, what we're doing is we're going to play a memory of this piece. And it's not just because we couldn't get the rights, I swear. This is going to be a group improvisation, or rather, a group meditation, if you'll allow me to be Californian for a second. I invited the artists in our process of rehearsing to call up a memory of a time that made them feel very peaceful. So I invite you to reflect on an image or a moment in your life that brought you peace, if you so wish, here in the audience and back home in the live stream. You're very welcome to close your eyes as well especially for those feeling screen fatigue. And we're just going to be present together. It's really special that we get to be here experiencing music together. Um, and I just wanted to honor that. And I promise that's as American as I'll be for this concert. Thank you. 
Romy and I. Hey. Hello. <laughs> We're going to play another song piece that is very close to home. This one is called Yao Dance, Yao Zu Wu Chu, and it's inspired by folk melodies from the Yao minority community and culture in China. A lot of contemporary Chinese music is inspired by folk melodies from the 56 ethnic minorities uh, that live throughout the country and have very different cultures. And we haven't performed this song since back in the day. So the last time this arrangement was performed was at home for dinner guests, begrudgingly. But today, we're going to be performing Yao Dance in St. Bartholomew's Great Hall for lunchtime guests and royalty, but happily. Me too? Not tuned yet. OK. What do you need? You need a fa? Uh, a fa? A me? Me? Oh, me? How about a fa? Oh, me, so me? Romy is um, tuning her guzheng back into D key before it was in G key. There you go.
So from here on, there will be less talking and more singing. So I originally thought that writing songs was a way to synthesize my Chinese and Western heritage. Um, but now I'm realizing that they, that the idea of unification, of coherence, sometimes be a little overrated. And I'm beginning to accept that it's all just flux. This song is called Strange. Sun's out and somehow the guys decide that I can come along. Hey, what do you say? We know a way. Come find us further on. They run off in twos to the railroad abandoned by the city long ago. I find my way, climb the wall, and somehow I decide to be alone. The trees are overgrown, and I can hear little voices in the stone. Sundresses sway on the balconies, graffiti in the tunnel goes for miles. These railroad tracks lead to God knows where. I believe I might be in a dream. Maybe I found a hat in this open world of video game strange as that may seem sometimes i believe in what i make but what if i'm just wasting time hey what do you do do you live here they say through see through smile Oh, are you still doing music? Is that the only instrument you play? I wander on and come upon a bridge that overlooks the street. I go to the edge and wave hello. No one seems to see A smile on my face, I go on my way Who knew alone could feel so free? These railroad tracks lead to God knows where I believe I might be in a dream Maybe I found a hack In this open world video game Strange as that may seem
I'm going to welcome Aidan Gurma to the stage. This song is called Weather Balloon. Great, thanks, Ollie. I'm setting out to sea, and I don't know. Tomorrow. All I know is that these waves are beckoning me to sail across this negative sky to my home, for I am searching for and searching for an answer to the sadness in the house. The weather balloon in a thunderstorm, a thunderstorm of all the days she longed to live without. Nothing looks the same. The tide has washed away the lighter shades now. The past of city in grain, the toughest tear of sediment deep underneath us, where she must be searching for. She is searching for an answer to her grief along the shore. Like a weather balloon in a thunderstorm, the thunderstorm of all. She was, she was searching for the notes. <laughs> she found, found the notes, though. She found the notes in the she end. Okay, <laughs> we have one more piece left. Um, I'd love to invite the full band to come to stage. Um, and while they're coming up, I want to say 
A huge thank you to uh, Bart's Heritage for having us and to City Music Foundation for the incredible support. They've been a lifeline in a very difficult time for musicians and they've honestly blown my mind with the amount of support that they've given. So um, please consider donating to them. It's going to a good cause. It's supporting artists like us. Um, if you're at home, there's a link, and if you're here, you can do that on the way out. Really, really genuinely grateful to them. So this next song is called Night and Day. And originally I wrote it about distance in love. And it was only afterwards that I realized um, in some ways it was about yin and yang. Thank you. 
Give it up for Michelle Cho Ed in Vermont, Eliza Millet on cello, Dave Shaw on violin, Alieta Kinzenkos on violin, Gordon Murray, and Romy Young. Woo Thank you so much. Thank you.